Hey guys, this is Josh Farley back with another video. Um, and in this video, I'm actually going to be doing uh, more T-Mobile 5G home internet speed tests. Um, so it is actually April 26th. Um, and if you guys don't know, if you're not familiar with the channel, um, I'm actually supposed to be getting a uh, upgrade in my area, particularly for the 5G. Um, they told me that it was going to be done around April 27th, which, which is actually Saturday. Um, so today's April 26th. It's 12:24 uh, p.m. Um, on a Friday. Um, so let's actually uh, get into this video. Um, so the first thing I always, you know, say is, you know, uh, I always, you know, let people know, you know, whether you're new to the channel or not, um, that I am actually using third-party equipment. I'm using a Chester Cheetah version two uh, cellular gateway slash modem, um, whatever you want to call it, with uh, band locking enabled. Um, and I also, you know, it also allows, um, you know, like, uh, like network mode switching and stuff like that and VPN, um, and just a lot of stuff, you know, that the, uh, the stock T-Mobile 5G home internet gateway, um, you know, doesn't allow you to do. Um, and also I'm using a, uh, waveform 4x4 antenna, um, that's actually connected to the Chester Cheetah version 2, um, up in my attic and it's actually facing out near an old truck stop. Um, facing out the window up in the attic near an old truck stop, um, you know, so that's, you know, the closest tower to me. Um, so let's actually open up the speed test app here, and I'll uh, run a couple on the West Norton PA server, and I'll run a, a few on the uh, Ashburn VA server as well. So that's definitely really good on that one. 612 for the download. So that was definitely a really good one for the download. 612, um, 9.40 for the upload. You know, like I've said, the upload is absolutely terrible in this area. Um, you know, it doesn't really matter what carrier you have. It doesn't you know, matter what, you know, cell carrier you have, you know, whether it be T-Mobile, um, you know, Verizon, AT&T, um, you know, MVNOs like Metro by T-Mobile, uh, Tello Mobile, which my mom has, which is a MVNO of T-Mobile, um, you know, just, um, I, I know people, you know, <clears throat> excuse me, I know people, um, that, that have different carriers around here, you know, Verizon being, you know, one of the best ones, you know, at least they claim they are, um, but, you know, Verizon hasn't actually been that good for me. I've, I've tried Verizon, um, and I only got like one, you know, I only got like one bar in my room, um, you know, and, and that's, you know, not going to work for me, you know, and I had, you know, it, it was always telling me Wi-Fi calling, um, so that, you know, tells you right there that you're not getting a good enough cell signal, um, you know, with, uh, T-Mobile, um, you know, I almost get full bars, as you can see up there, you know, at least like two or three, um, you know, compared to, you know, only one for Verizon, so, um, you know, they're, they're not really all they're cracked up to be, especially in rural areas, um, you know, I, I think that T-Mobile has them beat, um, you know, when it comes to, like, rural areas and stuff, um, you know, at least it seems that way, um, but on this one, you know, like I said, not bad, uh, download 612, um, 9.40 for the upload and only 21 ping. So that's definitely not bad. Ping actually did go up on this one, but, you know, still nothing to be concerned about. And like I said, you know, it is, uh, you know, it is Friday, you know, uh, 1228, you know, PM on a Friday, um, you know, so these are, you know, these are definitely really good speeds for a Friday, you know, people, um, you know, at work, you know, people at school still, um, you know, definitely not, definitely not bad at all, um, you know, for a Friday, Friday afternoon, but, um, on that one, you know, not bad though, 616 for the download, 5.50 for the upload, and then uh, 25 for the ping.
And like I said, you know, they are doing the tower modernization in my area, you know, still. So they, they told me it's going to be, you know, completed around April 27th. So, um, you know, I'm... I'm mostly hoping for better, you know, I'm, I'm mostly hoping for improved upload speeds. That's what I'm really hoping for. You know, and just, just all around re better reliability, you know, when it comes to the 5G network, you know. Uh, you know, not not only for the T-Mobile 5G home internet, like I've been saying, but for my phone as well. Um, you know, I want to, you know, be able to get better, you know, 5G connectivity for my phone, um, you know, especially if the, if the internet goes down or something, um, you know, like that, you know, I could just use my phone, um, you know, to tether stuff, you know, or stuff like that, um, you know, tethering stuff on 4G, you know, is okay, 4G LTE, um, but it's not, you know, it's not going to be as fast as 5G, um, you know, that's, you know, just, you know, common, um, you know, that's why 5G is going to be the next thing, because it's supposed to be a lot faster, um, and as you guys can see here, you know, it definitely is, um, you know, depending on what kind of equipment you have, um, you know, like I said, I don't, I don't have any stock equipment except for the, you know, the T-Mobile, uh, 5G home internet SIM card, um, you know, that's about the only, you know, stock thing that I have going here, um, but, you know, I, I still do actually get a weak 5G signal, um, you know, up in the attic, you know, with the, even with the waveform 4x4 antenna, um, you know, pointing out, you know, the window, you know, near the truck stop down the road, um, you know, that old truck stop down the road, so, um, you know, I'm, I'm definitely hoping that that improves, you know, that I can at least go from a weak signal to a good signal, um, you know, or, you know, to a very good signal or to a, um, you know, an excellent signal, you know, I'm not gonna, uh, I'm not gonna, you know, jump for, you know, uh, all that, but, um, you know, I, I would like to at least see it, you know, improve to the point where it, where it actually has a good 5G signal, um, you know, instead of a weak 5G signal, you know, especially for my, uh, phone as well, um, you know, I, I, I don't really get 5G coverage, you know, that good in this area, um, you know, especially, you know, in our house, you know, we have an old house that's over 100 years old, um, you know, and it's, it's got really thick walls and stuff, um, so I'm definitely, um, you know, hoping that I can, you know, get an improvement, um, you know, come April 27th, and the good thing is I'll actually be off work, um, you know, April 27th, because it's a Saturday, um, you know, I'm always off on the weekend, and in the summertime, um, I'll actually have more time to do speed test videos and more videos, um, you know, on my channel, because I'll actually have off Friday, Saturday, and Sunday, um, from work, so, you know, I'll, I'll definitely have more time, and I'm planning on actually taking vacation, um, I have, uh, like, four-day vacation days left, um, so I'm, you know, planning on taking them, you know, the start of summer, um, you know, just to, you know, kind of relax some, and then, you know, go back to work, but, um, but yeah, we'll, uh, we'll get to that when, you know, when we get to that, but, um, you know, I just want to let you guys know, you know, that I'll have more time, um, you know, to do more videos, you know, in the summertime, since I'll be having Friday, Saturday, and Sunday off, um, but, uh, this one wasn't that bad, though, 653 for the download, uh, 11.2 for the upload, and only 24 ping, so let me actually switch over to the Ashburn VA server here. That's weird. Uh, I must have spelled it wrong. Yeah, I always spell it wrong. I, I uh, type in like too many E's or something. And like I've said, you know, this, this server always does seem to give me a higher ping. I don't really know why, but... It does always seem to give me a higher ping for some reason. But this server also does seem to give me better upload speeds. So not bad on that one, especially for the download. 624 for the download, uh, 21.7 for the upload, and 82 ping. But like I've said, you know, with the... With, with the ping spikes and everything, with that, you know, going on like 102 ping right there, um, you know, that, that very well could be because they are working on the network, like I said, um, so you have to keep that in mind, you know, they're working on the towers, they're doing, um, you know, the tower modernization, so they did tell me about that, um, you know, when I, when I chatted with them online, you know, they told me, 
um, you know, until it's actually completed that I'll, you know, notice like ping spikes, um, you know, uh, slowdowns and then, you know, uh, faster speeds and then slowdowns, um, just, you know, not, not as reliable, um, you know, as it normally is, you know, while they're working on the network, you know, while they're working on the towers, um, so, uh, on this one, you know, not bad though, it did go down from 600 to 500, but, um, you know, still almost 600, 588 for the download, uh, 20, uh, 20 for the upload, and then 102 for the ping, but, you know, like I've said, you know, I don't, I don't think that that's really, uh, you know, too accurate, because the other, the, the other server, uh, you know, gives me lower ping, so, I think it's just because this server is further away. Not only that, you know, like I said, they are working on the, on the network and the towers in my area, so, um, you know, you have to keep that in mind. So not bad on that one though for the download, 647, uh, 22.4 for the upload and 65 ping, so the ping did go down, but I'll run one more on this server and then run a couple more on the, uh, the West Norton PA server. I don't really think that I would be getting these kind of download speeds, though, if the ping was that high, because it would take it a little while, you know, it would take it longer to, you know, get around there, and, you know, I, I just don't think that those are the kind of speeds that I'm actually, you know, the ping, you know, speed that I'm actually getting, or the, or the latency that I'm actually getting. So not bad on that one, 657 for the download, 23.4 for the upload, and then uh, 87 ping, but I can... I can do a test here. Let me actually open up ESPN. See how long it takes it to load. So, I mean, boom, right into it. So, let me actually see. Uh, let me open the Google Play Store. Let me download, you know, a random app, Timu. See how long it takes for it to download. That didn't take long at all. I mean, boom. You know, so I don't, I don't really think that that's accurate, you know, with that. I don't, I don't think that that's, you know, too accurate, with, you know, with that ping. Um, but, you know, you never know. I mean, but I don't, you know, it doesn't look like it because when I go back to the West Norton PA server, um, it'll, it'll give me slower, it'll give me less ping. And as you can see, you know, 24 for the ping, so... And it's been getting over 600 consistently today, so that's definitely good. Like I said, it is April 26th, you know, so we only have one more day until they, uh, you know, until they told me that it's going to be uh, completed. The, uh, you know, the tower modernization is going to be completed April 27th, according to what they said. So, um, but, you know, not, not bad on this one, though, uh, 638. Uh, for the download, 8.36 for the upload, and only 24 ping. Ping actually went down some on this one, so that's good. And it actually looks like I'm actually getting better, uh, like, like better, uh, you know, on the 600, you know, normally it would be like 620, 605, um, you know, stuff like that, but, uh, it actually looks like I, like I get a little bit of a speed improvement, actually, because it's like in the, it's like in the 650s, I, normally it's like in the 620s, um, you know, 630s, you know, 605, you know, 609, um, you know, 6, 10, 15, you know, stuff like that, um, you know, but that's, uh, you know, that's, that's, you know, definitely looks like a speed improvement to me, at least on the download, um, so not bad on that one, you know, like I said, 651 for the download, uh, 5.29 for the upload, and only 23 ping, run one more, so yeah, there goes another ping spike, as I, you know, as I say, it was, you know, looking better, but,
But like I said, you know, they are working on the network. You know, there's not really anything I can do about that. You know, it's still, you know, it's it's not April 27th yet. It's April 26th, so you have to keep that in mind. And and like I've said, you know, you also have to realize, um, you know, that there's other people using this tower. You know, I'm not the only one, um, you know, using this tower. The downside about this tower is um, it's actually right near an old truck stop. Um, you know, good thing that truck stop's not active anymore, because if it was, um, you know, there would definitely be more traffic there and stuff, um, you know, more people using that tower, so I'm hoping that they never actually open that truck stop again, um, you know, for, for, for my sake anyway, you know, because it used to have, like, a diner, um, and stuff there, you know, like, you know, like most truck stops do, um, you know, for the truckers and, you know, whoever else wants to eat there, um, but there, there used to be a diner there, you know, there used to be a whole bunch of stuff, you know, a gas station, obviously, um, you know, stuff like that, um, you know, a, a little, you know, food mart there, um, you know, stuff like that, where you get, you know, conveniences and stuff, um, you know, like a little, you know, convenience store, um, but, uh, you know, I'm, I'm really hoping that they don't open that up again, because the, the problem with that tower is, um, it's actually right near, uh, the interstate, um, you know, so, uh, right there, you know, there's a lot of, um, you know, like, traffic that comes by, you know, so it actually uses the, um, you know, tower a lot, you know, when people are going by, um, so that's, you know, that could also be a problem, um, you know, for me, you know, with the speed, you know, because, um, you know, people are using it, you know, constantly going by, um, you know, on the interstate and stuff, so that's, you know, another thing, you know, that you have to keep in mind, you know, that's right near an interstate, um, you know, and near an old truck stop, so, um, you know, there's, there's a lot of people getting on and off, um, you know, of the interstate there as well, um, that's actually the way that I go to work and come home, um, you know, so a lot of people, you know, use that, um, you know, use that tower, you know, so you have to keep that in mind, um, you know, and not, you know, not only that, um, but, you know, the time of day, you know, that's the time of day, you know, it's 12.41 p.m., um, you know, on a Friday, you know, there's a lot of people, you know, still at work, um, you know, there's a lot of people, you know, at school, you know, there's a lot of people, you know, going to pick up their kids from school, um, you know, shortly and stuff like that, um, you know, it's just a, you know, a busier time of day, um, you know, in the afternoon, you know, that's, you know, most of the time when the towers are really, um, you know, congested and stuff, so you have to keep that in mind, but, um, you know, still very usable, though, I mean, 556 for the download, I mean, I'm not worried about that, um, and a little bit slower on the upload, you know, 3.91, um, but like I've said before, you know, as long as you get over 3, um, for upload, I've read about that online, you know, that's sufficient for most households, um, I've read about that, you know, online on Cox Cable website, um, and they're, you know, actually a Cox Cable website, you know, they're actually a cable website, um, you know, and they're saying that, you know, so, um, you know, like, like I've said, you know, I don't have any problems with upload or anything, I don't have any problems uploading YouTube videos, um, I don't have any problems, you know, uploading, um, you know, things to Google Drive, you know, Dropbox, Mega, um, you know, stuff like that, you know, uploading to Facebook, Instagram, um, you know, I have noticed sometimes, you know, it can be a little bit, um, you know, a little bit slower, you know, than, you know, Comcast or Xfinity, um, but, you know, you're, you're, you know, getting a cheaper internet service, you know, and we're still getting, you know, really good download speed, um, you know, we're, we're only paying $40 a month, you know, for the T-Mobile 5G home internet, um, you know, and, and like I said, you know, it's gonna, it's gonna most likely only get better, um, you know, over time, like I've said, you know, before, it's still a newer technology, um, you know, 5G is definitely not, you know, there yet to replace 4G LTE or 4G, um, you know, anytime soon, you know, so you have to keep that in mind, um, you know, it's still a newer technology, um, and not only that, but, you know, like I said, you have to, um, also take into consideration, you know, the time of day, um, you know, you're, like, even if you have third, you know, third party equipment, you know, you guys can still see, you know, that occasionally, um, you know, I get slowdowns, you know, it's not going to always be, you know, boom, 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 um, you know, it's not going to always be 500 to 600, um, you know, on the dot, you know, that's not, you know, this, that, that's just not reality, because it's a cellular, you know, network, it's not, um, you know, wired, it's not, you know, directly coming into your house, like a wired connection, um, you know, it's not going to always be, you know, 100%, um, you know, fast, you know, it's not, you know, that's just not how it's going to be, 
um, so you have to keep that in mind, you know, like I've said, um, in my videos, you know, if this is right for you, or if it's not right for you, for me and my mom, um, you know, like I've said, you know, for me and my mom, um, you know, this is perfectly fine, you know, these speeds are perfectly fine, um, you know, but, you know, like I said, I am, I, I am hoping, you know, on April 27th, which is this Saturday, um, you know, I am hoping that I get more, you know, better reliability, um, you know, not only with the download, but also for the upload, you know, especially for the upload, um, you know, because the upload is, you know, still terrible in this area, um, but, you know, for the upload, for the ping, um, you know, just all around, you know, better reliability, um, you know, but we'll see, you know, tomorrow, like I said, um, but, uh, on this one, not bad, 556 for the download, like I said, you know, very usable for 1244 p.m., um, on a Friday, you know, 3.91 for the upload, and then, uh, 65 ping, you know, like I said, um, you know, they are doing, you know, the, the work on the towers and stuff and the network, um, so, you know, they told me about the ping spike, so, you know, I'm not really that worried about it. And as you can see, you know, the ping did actually go down on this one, so that's good. Might break 600 on this one, I'm not sure. No. So I have actually noticed, like I've said in my past videos this, these past couple of weeks, I have actually noticed that the upload speed um, has actually been worse than it's been, um, you know, why they've been working on the network or the towers. Um, so, you know, you, you want to, you know, uh, keep that in mind. You know, like I said, you know, they are doing the tower monetization and stuff. Um, but I have actually noticed that the upload speed has been, um, you know, worse than, you know, it normally is, you know, why they've been doing this. Um, so, um, not bad on that one, though, 592 for the download, 3.48 for the upload, and only 21 ping. I mean, that's definitely not bad for the ping. Ping went up by two on this one, but, you know, still, still nothing to worry about. Almost broke 600 on that one. And yeah, that's that's basically the main thing, you know, that I would like to improve, you know, or like, you know, them to improve, you know, is definitely the upload speed, you know. But, you know, like I said, I, I don't sit around, you know, and wait for something to upload, you know. I don't, um, you know, sit there at my computer or my phone and say, come on, come on. Um, you know, I, I don't, you know, do that, you know, I'm not, you know, really that worried about it, I'm not, you know, like a fanatic like that, you know, I don't really, um, you know, worry about stuff like that, you know, some people will be like, oh, this upload speed is terrible, um, you know, this upload speed sucks, you know, I'm, I'm switching carriers, but, um, you, you know, like I said, you know, it's still a new technology, 5G is still a new technology, um, you know, you have to give it a few years, you know, you have to give it a chance, um, you know, enable, you know, for it to, you know, really, um, you know, you know, get to the point where it can actually, you know, have its full capabilities, um, you know, you have to keep in mind, you know, right now, um, you know, it's still, um, you know, basically like in the beta stages, it's not, um, you know, widely available, you know, you know, some, some people can't actually get it, you know, some people actually can't get it in their areas, um, at all, you know, I, I actually had Verizon, I, I tried Verizon, um, for my cell phone, um, and, and this was less than a year ago, you know, I, I tried Verizon, um, for my cell phone coverage, and like I said, you know, I, I, I switched, you know, back to T-Mobile, because I, I could only get, like, one bar in my room, um, and most of the house, you know, most of my mom's house, I could only get, like, one bar, um, and, you know, I get more bars in, in the house with T-Mobile than I do with Verizon, um, but I also noticed that I couldn't get 5G, um, at all with Verizon, you know, I, I tried it, um, you know, countless places in the house, around the house, outside, um, and I couldn't get 5G at all, um, with, with, uh, T-Mobile, I can get 5G UC, um, in certain areas, like where I'm sitting right now, you know, in my sister's old room, um, making this video, I can, I can get 5G UC in this room, um, in a specific area, you know, if I sit in a specific area, um, so that, you know, basically tells you right there that 5G is still spotty, 
um you know it's still you know in the in like the beta stages if you will um you know so you have to keep that in mind you know that's not um you know really you know all the way there yet you know so you have to you know yet you know i'm i'm hoping um you know like i said i'm hoping you know come april 27th which is tomorrow um you know i'm hoping that i'm i'm gonna see a difference you know i'm hoping that i'm gonna get a better signal um you know i'm hoping that i get a better signal for the 5g home internet and my phone um and i'm also hoping that i get um you know uh sorry about that um um, I'm also hoping that I get, uh, you know, uh, you know, better, just, just better all around reliability. Um, but you know, it is what it is. You know, if I don't, um, you know, like I said, if I don't, I don't, you know, I do, I do, you know, it's, you know, basically like, um, you know, you know, you can't always have your cake and eat it too, basically, like they say. Um, but you know, like I said, I'm actually getting, you know, pretty good download speeds. Um, you know, you know, right now, you know, I'm getting 598 to 600, um, you know, on the download, you know, on this video, as you guys could see, um, and then, uh, 8.92, um, you know, for the upload, so that's definitely not bad at all, um, but, you know, like I said, I, I definitely, um, you know, do want to see an improvement on the upload, you know, that's the main thing, um, you know, that's, that, that's mostly why I'm not switching carriers, you know, switching to another internet provider, um, because the, the download is really good, um, but the upload, you know, is, is, you know, not, not, it's not like terrible, terrible, um, but it's definitely not, you know, the best, um, you know, so I'm definitely hoping, you know, come April 27th or a little bit after, um, you know, that I can just get better reliability, you know, all around the board, so, um, but like I said, you know, we'll see, um, but on this one, you know, not bad at all, like I said, almost 600, 598 for the download, um, 8.92 for the upload, and then, uh, 23 ping, I do apologize for that uh, text message coming through. I have my phone on Do Not Disturb, so I don't know why it's coming through like that. I don't know what, you know, would be causing that, but I have to look into that. So not not too bad on that one. Uh, five ninety three for the download, three point ninety eight for the upload, and uh, actually only twenty ping on that one. So definitely not bad. Let me run just one more here. So yeah, the upload speed has definitely been struggling while they've been doing this uh, this tower monitorization and like and, and I have actually had uh, YouTubers comment on my videos. I've had people comment on my videos and actually tell me um, that the uh, that the upload speed has actually been terrible for them recently. Um, so not bad on that one though for the download. 582 still getting 500 to 600 on the download. Um, you know, 582 for the download on that one. 3.98. Um, almost four for the upload, um, and then 25 ping. Let me actually check down detector um, and actually see um, if uh, they're saying anything about T-Mobile. Because I have them favorited in here. So yeah, it is actually in the red quite a bit there. As you can see, you know, there's a lot of red there. That's not good. Um, so it's actually saying uh, for mobile phone, 38% people are saying problems. Um, 29% for 5G home internet, um, you know, so that's definitely good, not good, or not good, yeah, um, so that's, you know, uh, that, that's still pretty high for the T-Mobile 5G home internet, 29%, um, and 38% for mobile phones, so that's definitely not good, let me actually run one more speed test before I go here, and then I'll get off of here, actually I have to get ready for work soon. That was actually my ride that texted me. I actually uh, get a ride back and forth to work now because I, uh, I've i been having problems with my car, so I have to get a ride for now. A friend of mine is taking me into work today.
So not bad on that one. Uh, 585 for the download, uh, 9.34 for the upload. So the upload did go up some. Um, and then uh, 22 ping, so definitely not bad. But um, anyway, yeah, guys, like I said, um, you know, I just wanted to get this video out there and, uh, you know, do some speed tests before I went to work today on a Friday. Um, you know, I'm really hoping uh, tomorrow, um, like I said, you know, tomorrow's April 27th, you know, Saturday I'll be home. Um, you know, so I'm really hoping that, uh, you know, tomorrow or at least later tonight, maybe even later tonight, um, you know, when I get home from work, you know, around 12 o'clock, um, you know, I'll, I'll probably run some speed tests and see if we see any changes, um, you know, because they told me April 27th, um, you know, that it was going to, you know, um, you know, I was going to, you know, see, you know, better reliability or faster speed, you know, she told me that um, on the T-Mobile, um, you know, chat, so I'm definitely hoping, um, you know, either later tonight, um, you know, or, um, you know, actually tomorrow, you know, Saturday, you know, actually tomorrow, you know, which would be considered Saturday, um, you know, that I, you know, see better reliability, um, or better, you know, better signal, um, you know, better signal strength, better speeds, um, you know, just all around, you know, better reliability. So I'll definitely, um, you know, be keeping you guys updated on this, you know, I'll be keeping you guys informed on this, um, you know, like I said, you know, like I like to say, I'll, I'll keep you guys in the loop about this, um, and let you guys know, you know, if I see any improvement or if I don't, um, you know, like I said, I'm not gonna, um, you know, I'm not gonna hold my breath on this, you know, like I said, we already get good download speeds, um, you know, so I'm not really worried about that, but it's the upload speeds, um, you know, that actually worry me somewhat, but, you know, like I said, I don't really sit around, you know, I, when I upload something, I don't sit around and say, come on, come on, um, you know, stuff like that, I don't, you know, uh, worry about it to that extent, um, you know, when it's done, it's done, you know, I don't, I don't really worry about that, I just go on and do something else, um, but, you know, like I said, you know, we'll see, um, like I said, it is only April 26th right now, um, you know, April 26th right now, um, so, you know, tomorrow's gonna be April 27th, so we'll definitely see, um, you know, on the day that they told me, you know, if there's any improvement, um, you know, I'll also be doing some speed tests on Sunday, most likely, um, you know, which would be April 28th, um, so we'll definitely see, um, you know, if there's any improvement, you know, either later tonight, um, you know, or, uh, you know, actually tomorrow, you know, tomorrow, tomorrow, um, you know, on Saturday. So, um, you know, like I said, you know, I just wanted to get this video out there. And if you guys like this video, please like and subscribe. And until next time, guys.